And Max actually was born as Max Suretsky in Leipzig in 1917. Had um, four brothers and a sister, and they enjoyed life. Sports was a big part of their life as they were growing up. My father joined the Maccabi Club and he participated in the youth games in Berlin in 1936. In 1938, in preparation for the third Maccabiya in Palestine, uh, he was part of the team of about 90 members from Germany to go over to uh, Palestine for the games. Unfortunately, uh, there was troubles at the time and the British mandate canceled the games. And a lot of the team went back home. He decided to stay in Palestine. While he was there, he received a letter from his mother saying that things had deteriorated back home in Germany. And once he's gone, don't come home. Stay there, do not come back to Germany. And so he never did. That was the last he actually heard from his mother. Because of his participation um, in 1936 to 1938 with the organization, the Maccabi organization in Germany, uh, he really attributed to saving his life. He, he would have been in Germany and uh, might not have ever gotten out. In Detroit, he decided to set up a youth organization and um, he participated in that organization to get the Jewish youth of Detroit uh, involved in sports and involved in the Maccabi movement. But what better mechanism is there than to have this type of sports organization that can bring Jewish youth from all across the world to one place to get to know each other and to give them an opportunity really to focus on what it is, what does it mean to be Jewish? What does that identity mean to them? What does the culture do for them? Um, once you've had this experience, you develop what my dad would like to call the, the Maccabi heart. Once you have a Maccabi heart, you understand your relationship with, with your people, with your heritage and your country and the land of Israel, you never lose it.